Hey, what's up? It's Kadichigo. Get to continue Pikmin 3 Deluxe. At the end of the last episode, we had one arm scissor and we saved Captain Charlie, but now I'm back to do this solo Delo. I think we wanted to go back to the end of the, uh, you know, the last little area we were in and collect the last little bit of fruit that we were able to get. I think now that we're a trio again, uh, we can actually access the last little bit that we couldn't previously. Yeah, at this point, it's probably the best bet just to uh, get a nice backstock of, you know, fruit juice for the crew. Make sure we don't have to worry about that in future endeavors, I guess. Or as much, or whatever. Okay, so we saw this, so I will, uh, yeah, just skip forward to actually in the day or whatever. Give me one second. Okay, yeah, back we go to the distant tundra so we can collect the last bit of fruit that we didn't, uh, get previously. I know of, I think, four, you know, just off the top that we can go get kind of right away or whatever, and... I guess then just explore around, see what else we can get. I know there's maybe, like, a part or something, like, I don't know if it's for the ship or... Just something that's gonna help us out more. I think that we can pick up as well, so... Yeah, it should be a nice little, uh... I don't know, just like, collect-a-thon kind of a day here. Let's see. I'm trying to, uh, think of my first order of business. I do know about that one, uh, orange I think we can get in the cave, back where, uh, we fought the boss. Or on the way to the boss. Like where we, uh, found Captain Charlie there. I think I can get them with just a couple yellow guys, so... Probably go do that right away. Man, it was convenient having one arm scissor here just to, uh, you know, have, like, two, you know, players going at once. Because I don't think the days are, like, cut any shorter because of the, you know, handicap or whatever. I really do think it actually, uh, gives you the same amount of time. Need to look into if that's actually accurate or not, but... Yeah, it was, uh, definitely, you know, a little bit helpful, but... For this day, I should be able to collect the remaining fruit and, you know, just the, uh, the amount of time that I have by myself here. Now that I have all three, you know, of, uh, of the crewmates back. Oh god, <laughs> they're all falling down in the abyss. I'm sorry, you guys. I didn't mean for you to fall down there. I forget how many have to, uh... Oh no, fuck. That was not what I wanted. Stay up there, boys. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I forget how many actually need to be up there to carry the the orange. Let me see, I'll throw Charlie up there and then, uh... There we go. Simple as that. Oh, only five? Carry that big ol' orange? Okay. Guess that makes sense. We are doing good on yellow boys. I would go sacrifice a couple reds or something to the, uh, the little flower boy there, but I do think we are good at this point, so now that we have that, I think we can probably just head out. I don't think there's really anything else of, a uh, yeah, of note to really, like, worry about in here. Although, this I do think we're gonna have to come back to, but alas, we are not actually able to access that yet. If I am, uh, yeah, correctly informed on what that really is. No, you guys need to come. Why are you staying down there? Yeah, come on. Stay with the squad. Alright, we'll uh, roll back out here now that they got the orange. I think there's a couple little things also in uh, another little area. Yeah, up, up top here, right? Let's see, how do we get up here? I think there's something we can possibly collect. Actually, hold on, I may be wrong. No, yeah, it's not this area, actually. Totally wrong, it's another little snowy area. There we go, there's the orange recovered back, so... We are all good on that aspect. And now we will continue forward, see what else we can get here. I believe everything on that side is pretty much taken care of, so... Yeah, we will, uh, not worry about going over there anymore. I think the only things that we can access over there will be... Once, you know, we get the... The blue boys, the water pikmin themselves back in the, uh, in the action. Until then, I think we... Just gotta focus on the ones that we know over here. Let's see, I do know about the one... I think it's, uh... Like the grapes and the, uh, the kiwi or whatever. I think those are the next best bet here. The go after or whatnot. Oh yeah, we can go back in there now that, uh... Got this down, although we don't really need to. I think we got pretty much everything we need to from there. Oh, may as well send a couple of these guys over here. Let's see, how many do we need to carry that? I forget what this even is, but I'm sure this will come in handy. This place is full of uh, little surprises. We need to get this back to the Drake for analysis ASAP. Oh, it's ten of them? Okay. No, lock back on. I love how after the cutscene it fucking detoggles my lock on. That's awesome. <laughs> totally love that. Ooh, I need to send the, the rest of the boys down there because... I was going to say, no, lock on to him. Can I get him from here? Ooh, yeah, there we go. Get him, boys. Show him who's boss. Okay, there we go. 
Man, those are always some of the most annoying enemies. Swear to God. Uh, let me give the rest of these little boys down here. I guess I'll keep my rock man and then... Let's see, we will, uh... Go get these other little, uh... Things that we need to get over on this side. Let me, uh... Try to knock my boy down here so he's not in our way. There you go, everybody attack. Charge attack that bitch, there we go. And now... Ooh, analyzing. Oh, they're gonna show us what that part was. We're receiving a transmission from the Drake. Yeah, what is this little flute thing? <laughs> analyzing item. Analysis complete. This is an optional part that adds a dodging feature to a regular whistle. Wait, what? I wonder if these are the same optional extras I saw in that spacesuit shop on Kopai. Oh, it's even got an instruction manual with it. I'll save it in the exploration notes. So like a dodge so I can make them, like, roll out of the way? Okay. Roll and dodge, interesting. I'll have to test out how that actually works. It's kind of cool, though. Hopefully that'll help me, uh, you know, avoid getting a bunch of my Pikmin, like, smashed to death or whatever. <laughs> Might, uh, actually really come in handy, now that I think about it. Cool, I bet this will get me out of more than a few tight spots. I mean, Alf isn't, uh, really used to a whole lot of tight spots, if you know what I'm saying. I don't really think my boy, uh, you know, has too much, uh, experience with the ladies. Which, you know, I could be totally wrong with, you know, a little guy like him, you know, he may get, a uh, may get plenty of girls back, you know, on his home planet. <laughs> Who am I to judge, I guess? Just a little goofy tuft of hair and shit. Whoa, okay, they're <laughs> accepting the new fruits at a fucking way too fast of a level here. Okay, I need to throw Brittany, and then she'll bounce her way over here, and then I'll throw the rest of the boys. And I guess Alf will just wait over here by himself like a loser. While Brittany goes and handles the business. Oh yeah, there's the orange here, but uh... Need to make sure we get these guys out of the way. I don't have enough of the yellow boys there who really needs to, uh, come through and, you know, show and prove right here. There you go, boys. Get them out of the way for your fellow Pikmins. For your fellow Mins to do their work. So now I think, yeah, this will build the bridge over here, right? Yeah, because before I was over here and I totally forgot, like, how do you even, like, actually, like, get to this part in this area over here? But, yeah, now that I remember, you, uh... Gotta get up here from bouncing across. Totally forgot you uh, actually had to like access this area after you had all three of your party members back. Okay, we definitely need more red boys than yellow boys, so I will let them carry some bodies here. Go uh, replenish their numbers to a certain extent, I guess. Then continue on with the fruit hunt. Let's see. I wonder how many we need to carry this. We already got one orange in this this day, and it was only like five Pikmin, so. I think we should have more than enough, but I do think I'm gonna have to go over here and figure out how to, uh, yeah, finesse this other little piece that's over here. Actually, now that the bridge is up, this little, like, pinecone bridge we built, I think these homies can just come straight over. Because, wait, who has... Yeah, he has all the rock boys. There he is. Okay. Let me just, uh, actually pass them all over to Brittany, so maybe Brittany can just go handle it herself, actually, now that I think about it. Seems like more logical of an option. Come on, me little, uh, little rock boys. Gotta go, uh, do your thing. We definitely gotta replenish some of the rock boys' numbers, though. Before we, uh, get too crazy in the next little area. Because we do not have too many of them left. And they are, uh, definitely, you know, a vital resource in, uh, in our ongoing pursuit of fruit on this planet, I guess. Okay, here we go. This is where they're gonna come in handy. Gonna have to do some dodging and evading, boys. Can you tuck and roll? Oh, shit. See, this is where that, uh, the little, like, uh, whatever, the thing we just unlocked, where they can, like, apparently dodge and evade and stuff. I really need to see, like, how that works and, you know, if we can actually access it already. Ooh, they're gonna give us a little gray thing for the rock boys. Okay, cool. Definitely gonna be able to already replenish a couple numbers by the end of the day here. Not that we've lost any, uh, really this day or whatever, but the past few days we have, you know, taken a couple casualties here and there. Not, uh, you know, been the greatest on that front or whatever. Okay, now we can give these to the rest of the rock boys. 
And they will uh, continue to grow their little numbers there. Not sure if we're going to make it, but I do think there is like one last little uh, vine of grapes that we can get. I think it's back towards the actual yeah, boss fight that we did the last episode. Should have probably just gone for that right away. Totally forgot that was over here. I can at least like maybe get some of it a uh, part of the way back. I don't know. I have like one last little chunk of daylight left, so maybe I can pull this off here. It's got to go really, really fast. <laughs> uh, it's probably going to have to be the yellow Pikmin that uh, actually do the job here. Oh, I forgot I have all these pickups and stuff over here. Oh, and I do know about one other little thing that I totally forgot to get. I'm going to have to uh, yeah, accomplish that when I come back. You know, whenever I get the blue Pikmin, I know we're going to have to come back to uh, you know, accomplish some last minute pickups with those boys. So, yeah, we will have to uh, probably try to accomplish a whole bunch on that, you know, that one day or whatever. And we come back. Okay, so here we have the grapes up there. Let's see how far we can get back. I'm counting on you boys. <laughs> Basically just gonna follow them just in case they don't get all the way back and I can just, uh, you know, call for them to get back to my aid or into the group so they don't die. Get left alone on the planet forever. That is enough, right? Okay, thank god. Okay, and then we need to get the rest of these boys. Oh, they're gonna go this way? Is this way really gonna be faster? I totally forgot we opened, like, a new, uh, yeah, route or exit over here. I really hope, uh, yeah, we don't have to worry about any more enemies in here. I think we took care of them when we did the boss fight, right? Then we just go out the little, uh, the little hole. The little fucking glowing hole of freedom. <laughs> Yeah, and back over the box. I think we're gonna make it, boys. Oh my god. I think we're actually gonna get the other, uh, the other grape. Like, vine or whatever. And then, like, the little hole came in clutch. Look at that shit. We're really gonna fucking get this. Hell yeah. No, you guys don't go back. Don't go back. We're good. We're good. No, you fucking idiots. Come back. Why are they going away? Oh my god. They do not need to fucking go back. Why are they doing that? I guess that's my next, uh, order of business is before the fucking, like, sunsets. I need to actually go back there and, <laughs> like, uh, yeah, make sure that they get back in the party. Oh my god, you fucking morons! Why would they do that? I wonder, like, what, you know, uh, method of, I don't know, action you have to take to try to avoid that? Because, like, they automatically go back to the spot even if there's nothing else there. Which totally, uh, yeah, can, like, mess up plans and, like, uh, yeah, definitely leave... More than a bargain for, or, you know, than hoped for, or whatever, like, out in the field. Alright, they're just gonna be sitting over here. I got nine seconds to go grab them. <laughs> oh my god. You guys did your job, and I'm proud of you, but... Man, you really made that, uh, you know, a little too close for comfort there. Getting any of you guys back. I think there's still, like, one guy out in the field somewhere, but... Alas, they will just have to be, uh, lost in nature. Apparently. We did our job for the day. <laughs> collected enough fruits, so... Ah, uh, I feel bad, uh, leaving any out. I don't know why this game has a, you know, real way of, like, making you feel bad about the Pikmin you leave behind, but... You know, all is, uh, fair in love and war, right? <laughs> is that the saying? Pretty sure that's how it goes. All is fair in love and Mikmins. Oh, there's a little, like, uh, cave thing I guess I didn't dig out over there. I like how I just noticed that now, after, like, However many, uh, you know, like, days on this little area now. <laughs> oh, wow, the fire bulb orb ate the fire Pikmin that we left behind. It's, uh, dramatically beautiful in a way. <laughs> Cinematic nature is. Alright, well, I think overall, that was a very lucrative day. We got a lot of fucking fruits. Look at all this shit. Two oranges, two grapevines, a kiwi. Can't wait to taste the new fruit. Analyze the citrus lump. Oh, this sequence is going to take a while. I love the fucking fruit juicing sequences. They're always so, like, satisfying and just nice to watch. So, yeah, we got that one little part that apparently is going to allow, like, the Pikmin to, like, dodge and roll. So I'm going to have to, like, look into how you actually, like, do that or whatever. It'll, uh, hopefully come in handy, but... Not going to lie, I did know about one other, you know, little, like, I don't know, tech equipment, you know, pickup or whatever you want to call it in this game. Like, a uh, you know, like, bonus pickup thing that you can get, and... Yeah, totally forgot, uh, to try to even go, you know, and actually, like, acquire that. I did not end up having enough time to go back for it, but... I think it's, like, either 
an anti-electricity kind of like suit or something for the guys, for the crew, but I don't know. It's something that, you know, you can definitely like still get through, you know, the next few levels or whatever without. Probably would just make certain instances easier, but. Oh man, look at the lime juice. It's so pretty. Love the neon green color. Well, yeah, we are definitely stocked up on juice here. I don't think we have to worry about, uh, you know, falling behind as far as uh, that is concerned. We can now use our radar to locate fruit. Wow, really? I kind of already thought we could do that. That's actually interesting. Oh, wow, okay. That's definitely going to come in handy. Okay. Knowing this is waiting at the end of the day makes it all worth it. If only I didn't have to share it with the others. I love how she says that multiple times. Like, that's always her thought process. I mean, you guys have so many. I'm surprised, like, uh, somebody doesn't get greedy and start going into the supply and the rations. <laughs> but no, they're all, uh, you know, seems like a pretty reliable crew overall. Like, they're all in it for, you know, for the end goal of, like, you know, taking it back to their planet for, you know, overall gain for, like, their people and whatnot. It's so good to, uh, build our juice supply like this. We should all be alright for a little while. Yeah, definitely uh, got decent supply at this point. I was a little bit worried about it for, you know, a couple episodes there, but at this point, you know, I think we got it in the bag. We grew our numbers of Pikmin. Yeah, overall, this was a very positive day. I think uh, we definitely needed this going into, you know, going to the next new area, so should be a nice new little venture waiting for us now that we're all uh, stocked up and ready for it. Tropical Wilds. Let's go, uh, let's go check it out. 18 pieces of fruit there. Now that we have the fruit tracker, that should, uh, yeah, definitely be a little bit easier to find, but... Damn, I think that's possibly the most, you know, uh, pieces of fruit out of any area we've been to so far. Find the cosmic key drive. That is our objective overall, right? It seems that the signal originated from this area. That treasure hunting Olimar must be here somewhere. You know, this is the first place I landed on this planet. Was he really here with our key this whole time? Plenty of time for nostalgia later. Let's track down that signal, and don't pass up any fruit we see on the way. Even after we just got, like, so much backstock from the last little, uh, <laughs> last day we just had there. Okay. Well, let's get our little crew out. Trying to, uh, figure out what's exactly going on here with our numbers. So we definitely still need to work on some rock boys overall, but... We have enough to have just a full, you know, like a good little full squad here. Let's see, if we go 35, 35, and 30? Probably good enough for right now for whatever we gotta go encounter up ahead here. Let's see. I don't think we can do anything about these, right? The rock boys can't do anything. No, yeah. Oh, I think that's what the, uh, the little exploding rock things are for, right? If that's still a thing in this game, I'm assuming it's probably similar. Again, I have played this before, but it was only once, like, when this game, uh, yeah, like, the deluxe version came out originally for the Switch, like, three years ago or whatever. That was the only time that I had played it, and I have not, uh, really, like, you know, messed around or done too much with it since then, so... Yeah, overall, still definitely plenty of this game that, uh, you know... Uh, escapes my memory, so to say. But I do believe that, you know, if, uh, you know, just memory and Pikmin games serves me right, that is a wall that you have to blow up with those little exploding, like, uh, yeah, exploding rock things. I'm gonna have to sneak up on this guy. Ooh, what the fuck? Oh, I don't like these guys. I remember them being a fucking pain in the ass. This may just be, like, more of an exploring day than anything else. Yeah, take him out. As long as you got a hundred working on him at once, like, usually a big bull borb is, uh, no chance in my, my, uh, what's it called? Experience. Wait, what? Huh. <laughs> I was like, wait, what are they doing? Did I just, like, fuck up? They just all jumped down in there. Uh, maybe, like, I don't know, we need, like, a different type to do something there? That's interesting. All right, I do see this thing, so we're gonna have to dig this up. May as well, right? Ooh, that's a big old weird orange. Is that like some kind of weird special orange that I'm just not aware of? With like a grapefruit or some shit? Why does it have like a weird little bulb on it? Why does it got like a butt? Or like whatever? 
I don't understand what that little, like, bulbous part is. I don't love it. Well, overall, we already got one little part here, so... Oh, man. I wonder if... Can we actually, like, make it across here? Yeah, we can. Okay, so I'm gonna have to send a couple Pikmins over with Brittany. Go explore what's over here. Actually, let's just send the whole squad over. We'll just leave Alf behind. And then maybe we can get the, uh, the bridge going. Ooh, is this a pretty waterfall? Oh, there's like a peach up there. Can I, uh, can I get the yellow guys up there? Most likely. I'm gonna assume they're gonna be okay. Are they gonna, like, die because of the water? Oh, God. Yeah, actually, that might not work out the way I want it to. <laughs> I may need the, uh, the blue Pikmin for this. Let me just, like, see. I'm pretty sure they're gonna get fucked up if they touch the water, though. Okay, yeah, we can't do that until we have the blue Pikmin, unfortunately. I wonder if this is where we're actually supposed to, like, get them. Oh, shit! Okay, here. This is where we have to, uh, get the little bomb things from, right? Yeah. I'm pretty sure the yellow boys are the ones that we want to handle these, even though they're, like, fire rocks. I remember the yellow ones being the ones that carry them. I found a mysterious rock, but it doesn't appear to be edible, but it could come in useful. Could come in useful. I guess that's proper English. <laughs> Uh, that was an interesting sentence. I'll keep the Pikmin carrying it separate from the others and press L and R to select it. Because, yeah, we're going to need a couple of them, right, to uh, get past that one little, uh, one bridge, or uh, wall, even, that we uh, saw a second ago, I think. So, is this where they're going to find the little bombs? Pretty sure this is where they're supposed to get them from. Oh, they're digging, boys. Is it going to be faster if I throw a couple more down there? Oh, shit, there we go. Yeah, they were down there. So I think I need at least three, if I remember correctly, for, uh, you know, each individual wall to break down or whatever. Thank you, Yellow Pikmin. Again, coming in clutch. Uh, so yeah, this was what you need to, uh, get some of these certain specific, like, stone walls down. Yeah, the Yellow Boys need to have those little bomb things with them. Oh, and now there's another little bridge here. Maybe this is a shortcut. Well, wait. So, can these guys, like my Pikmin, get back to the ship from here? Because I do have this, like, grape that I can get. I'm kind of worried about sending them on it yet. I kind of want to scope out the rest of the situation. Because which way are they going to go if I, like, send them out with the grape? Let me follow one of them and make sure that they're actually going to be safe here. Yeah, they're going to go this way, right? And then they just wait for the... Ah, uh, okay, they're waiting for the bridge, so we have to figure that out first. Well, there's some of it right here. Okay, so... Ooh, and there's like an electric little fence there, so... There is some stuff to be done here. As far as, uh, stuff we actually can do here. Alright, what is in here, boys? Hopefully it's the rest of the, uh... What's it called? Oh, no, I was gonna say, no, this looks like a fucking boss arena or something. We are not ready for that! <laughs> we will come back to that at a later time, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, right now, I just want to figure out how to actually connect back to the, like, ship and everything. What the fuck? Ooh, I see some kind of fruit up there. Yeah, there's definitely gonna be a couple little things we're gonna have to come back and access, but... Man, I really wanna know, like, just where the rest of this little bridge is. That would make a whole lot of this, uh, this point a whole lot easier. Oh, uh, well, we're getting close to the end of the day, and I'm not sure exactly where the last few pieces of the bridge are. We got most of it built there, but... Yeah, maybe it's, like, in this weird little central area. Not exactly sure how to get up here, so... Yeah, kind of mostly just an exploring day. I know we have a pretty good back stock. I don't want to, you know, do too many days that are like this, where kind of more reckless with, you know... Didn't get any fruit, didn't really get, like, a whole lot of major things done, but... Kind of explored the area, saw what's going on, you know, overall in this little, uh... God, I hate those fucking frog guys. <laughs> PTSD from them. Uh, yeah, kind of just saw, you know, overall what's going on, and... Yeah, we'll have to, I guess, figure out where the last little pieces of the bridge are, so we can actually come over and start gathering fruit here. Oh wow, yeah, we actually did get a fruit today, so... Overall, we just, like, basically broke even, or whatnot, you know, so to say. Wow, that thing was... Oh. <laughs> I was like, wait, why was... Why was the juice, like, pink? I thought it was an orange. Super tra uh, interesting. We got one fruit, why is there three files that we just got? <laughs> A little confused there, but okay, cool. We worked hard and now it's time for our reward. But yeah, so they are plenty stocked up now. We're, uh, yeah, definitely at a good place going into the next episode here, so. 
Pretty excited, got the new area going on, got a bunch of new little uh, surprises and uh, things to go explore, so... Yeah, this should be a, yeah, a good little starting point for yeah, like the, uh, the next episode or whatever. At this point, I think I do want to wrap it up there, so... I yeah, just want to take a second to say thank you so much for watching. It really means a lot when anyone takes the time out of their day to check out any of the content or any of the videos, so yeah, thank you so much. It really means a lot to me. If you like this video, give me a like on it, give me a subscribe on the channel, come on back next time. I do all kinds of other retro playthroughs of older games, usually uh, a bit older than this. This is kind of a, you know, in the realm of like newer stuff that I, you know, usually check out on the channel. Most of the stuff is from, a, uh, you know, like a, yeah, a good amount of like retro stuff or like newer indie developer stuff, you know, that is new, but is kind of like going for like an old throwback kind of a retro look or whatever. Usually what I go for on the channel, but I do bounce around from uh, all kinds of stuff, PC stuff, PS4 stuff, uh, Switch stuff. You name it, but yeah. If you like this video, give me a like on it, subscribe on the channel, and yeah, come on back next time. I'd really appreciate it. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to get out of here. Peace out. Get it, you go.